You know, I don't really mind helping the next guy out and being the nice guy when the nice guy needs to be the nice guy. That's me, nice guy Pete. But, you know, enough is enough when it comes to the situation of saying, look, dude, this isn't a permanent home for you. This is something that you have to decide to do to get off your ass because you're the one that wanted to live in a trailer the rest of your life, not me. So, okay, we got dogs coming over here. Okay, hold on. What's going on, boy? Easy, 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 buddy, easy. Uh, did I tell you that I live in an Airbnb neighborhood and there's strangers that live around me on a constant daily basis? No, I didn't tell you that, but yeah, those are all Airbnbs over there, people. I don't even know if you can see them, but they're there. Trust me, they're there. What's this fucking noise I'm listening to? What the fuck is going on in my fucking shop in front of my fucking business, place of business? What the fuck is happening? Wow, I can't believe it. Now, not that the squatter is squatting, he, he disconnected his truck, uh, the trailer from his truck, and now, uh, squatter guy has literally got his generator running out of control over here for power. Right here. So, it's approximately 8 o'clock in the morning out here on a beautiful Friday, and, uh, Squatter guy uh, <laughs> has not packed his shit up yet. Let's get a little talk with him and see what's going on. Um, hopefully he'll talk to us. Hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> Серой болью всю душу свело, как аина серебряной пылью, все дороги пути замело, а возьми в школу я посещала, где сидеть сиротою была, а пятнадцатый мне миновала, я курила, ругалась, пила. No, not yet. So it's Today's the day, guy. Yeah, I've been getting stuff straightened up in here. Yeah, I hear that. That that generator woke me up. That thing's so loud. That fucker ain't fired. I, think, fucker, it, I eight, think it bothered our Airbnb. Eight o'clock. Our, our Airbnb renters over here woke up in the middle of the night and listened to it. No, 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 no. I didn't fire it up till eight o'clock this morning. Huh? Because I could have sworn I was out here at seven thirty and it was running. Seven thirty-eight. Wow. Yeah, I, I, when I got this morning, I started. Okay, so is today the day or? That's it, my day is today. I'm heading to Green River. I'll be out of here before noon. Okay, all right, we'll uh, keep in contact with you. Uh, Always. Always. You know, it's an exciting day. You're actually moving. Yes, yes. After two two full weeks of being on my property being squad. Being a squatter. Yeah. <laughs> okay. How's your dog? Where's your dog at? Oh, he's right here my leg. Here he is. Okay. Yeah, right. What the hell is that? Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to come in. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. We'll see you later. Guys. I'll talk in a bit, but we'll I'll... be talking to you in a little while. I gotta go to town. All right. Talk in a bit. Okay. See you later. Drive safe. Yeah. Sure. So um, you can see that it's going to be an exciting day today because Squatter is leaving. Uh, it's making my property look bad, people. It's making me look like a dump over here. Having this thing parked in my yard with a truck disconnected and a generator going. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Oh, son of a bitch. That generator gas, the smell of the, the fumes got to me there just for a split second. Uh, let me show you what I'm looking at. All right, look at this. Look at this mess right here. 
um, because we don't have nowhere to put our stuff, see? And, and normally what we would do out here in the front, we'd go ahead and put a couple trailers out here, you know, kind of jazz it up, make it look like a U-Haul store. But instead, it looks like a uh, trailer trash mobile home park out here at my friend Pete's, right in front of my beautiful garden. Right in front of my beautiful cactus garden that I love, love so much. We need to get this guy off my property, get the fuck out, and don't come back for at least another three or four months, guy. At least three or four months. Теребиты поломаны крылья, серой болью всю душу свело. Кокаина серебряной пылью все дороги пути замело. А вашли школу я посещала, где сидеть сиротою была. А пятнадцатый мне миновала. Я курила, ругалась, пила Pull it up ahead. Oh, Go ahead. I'll tell you when. Oh, right there. That's good. How's it going out here, buddy? Oh, excellent. Okay. I heard you talking to yourself. I thought I'd come out here and make sure everything was yeah. all right. How, how good I am backing up and putting in the post without That's having That's pretty a good. You don't even have a camera on That's this right. old truck. That's right. Uh, I think it'll slide over in there. I'm, I'm pretty sure it will. Yeah. Now remember, before you put that down all the way, you got to hook up your uh, binders can... and chains. And then once you do that, then the weight will keep the truck in sync. Um, I've had three other people tell me a different way of doing it, and, okay. what, they, and what they tell I've told okay, me. Okay, well then do it that way. I, I mean, am. I was just giving you my advice. Exactly. Have you ever heard? I'm giving you what I've heard now is leave the ball hooked, okay? Uh -huh. Then jack your load up, and then attach. Okay. And when it well, doesn't, that's what I was saying. I mean, you could do the same thing by putting the ball on there and hooking it, and yeah. before you lower it all the way. Yeah. That's the same thing, dude. Yeah. It's exactly the same thing, guy. All right, all right. All right. Okay. But go ahead, go ahead and jack it all the way down, put it on there, and then jack it all the way up. Yeah, and I, I do. I, that was the exact same thing I just my, said. It's my load that I'm hauling, so I like to do it my way. Yeah, there I you think, go. I think, I think so, so And I'm you're 70 it. years old. That's right, and I'm still kicking. And you can do it your way. That's right. Because it's your truck. What happened over here, bud? You got that fixed. Right here. Son of a bitch. How'd that happen? Well, that damn work. Well, they've been from here. I've been here in uh, Arizona, uh, oh, 191. Hell. They got up. They've been doing bridge work doing the washouts, apparently. Oh, so you hit the trailer? No, oh, I no. hit a hit a damn. It was a cone that did suck out just a little bit too far off the yeah. part where they're working. What I'm looking at though is actually loading up and hitting the road. That's it. Is that what we're doing here? Yes, yes. Uh, I'll be about 60 miles from here. Yeah, and I'll, that's great. I'll be, I'll be in the yelling distance. Well, let's get that thing hooked up. Show us how it's done, buddy. Okay, so our squatter guy, he's leaving. He's leaving us and hopefully not coming back for a while. That's what I'm saying. I got a lot of work to do in this last two weeks. I haven't done jack shit except fuck around with him and be Mr. Fucking, yeah, that's good. Mr. Fucking uh, Hostess. Hostess, you know what I feel like over here, bud? Now that I feel like a Hostess cupcake. I feel like I'm a Hostess cupcake. I just feel that way. That's that's how I feel. You sure tell I'm awake this morning. Why is that? What did well, you do? Well, I got I to take the blocks off my knees and fucking trailer before I can move the goddamn jack down. Oh, so you didn't get your blocks. <laughs> well, look what happened here, buddy. You didn't. That's what I said. Don't you got to take the yeah, blocks I out did. before you let the yeah, jack yeah, down? Well, guy. I mean, I know you want to stay here. I know you want to, you don't want to leave, but I mean, come on, guy. Let's get our shit together here and, and get stuff done. So uh, he decided he was going to put the trailer on his truck, but he forgot to take the jack stands out uh, before he let the trailer down. Get him away. Excuse me. Okay, no problem. Okay. I'm to get the hell out of here. Oh. Yeah, see, that's... I did that once before, too. What the fuck? I'm going back and forth. It's got to be something sticking out. I can't be the actual weight and all that shit. What year is this trailer? Uh, the old Skipper? 
Oh, 04. 04 model. Now, is it used and abused or is it in pretty good shape? Pretty good shape, actually. Girl, wouldn't have bought it. Now, how much did you get for this thing? How much did you pay for it? Yeah. Nine. $9,000. Wow. For an 04 job. But it fit me. And that's all that counts. That's all that counts. Now, does the awning work? That's all it works. Oh, okay. That's all brand new. I haven't used it. Oh, wow. Wow. It's a beautiful trailer. Beautiful pull behind. Yeah, why didn't you get a mob why didn't you get one of them drivable motorhomes and then get a Jeep to pull behind that? Because my my son was originally gonna go with me. Oh. And so I bought a trailer so we both fit in it. That kind of scenario and then have a truck to drive around. How's your teeth doing? You They're doing fine. Doing you good. don't have the bottoms yet. No, I gotta let my jaws a little sore put them in. You gotta take, go back up there and get an adjustment. Yeah, I'll call him up Monday and give him a buzz. He's got so damn close. Let's get this thing loaded, okay? Guy, let's get her done, buddy. We got, you know, I got work to do. Quit talking to me and I'll get out of here. But I got work to do. And I'm over here babysitting. I feel like a hostess cupcake. A hostess Twinkie. Okay, take the Twinkie and cupcake off, and that's what I feel like. A hostess. My friend Pete's the hotel system here. My friend Pete's parking lot. My friend Pete's free free amenities. My friend Pete's everything. What the fuck? Okay? Let's get her done. Let's get her done, guy. Get her done. Let's get her moved. Guy. You can't hear me. He's talking to himself. And he's not listening, people. He's not listening. He doesn't give a shit. Doesn't give a shit. Uh, you know, if he wants to get mad at me, that's his his prerogative to do that. Uh, but I got I got commitments that I got to deal with, and, and I got a lot of work in my shop that I've been fucking around since he's been here, and I should have been working on that, which is what I'm gonna fucking be doing as soon as he gets his shit together and gets the fuck out of here. You know, squatters. Uh, what are we gonna do with him, son of bitches? That's all I can say. Did you see my uh, tire rack I made here? For I the, seen it. Did you see that right here? Look. That way, if you're out in the if you're out Is in the the, the boonies and you don't have a wrench, you can always just use a rock. Is that underneath a uh, underneath the hood? That's underneath the hood. Oh, cool. The stud was put here 30 years ago, but nobody ever used it because I don't think they ever knew what it was for. <laughs> Where they carry their tires at during but the race. He never had a tire here. This was never used. He said he never carried a tire. He didn't know he didn't know why they put that there. But anyway, what the real deal is, is we got our buddy Skipper here that's all packed up and ready to go. So you got your teeth. You beat your dog yesterday for getting in your dirty clothes. And 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 he's a piece of shit, but we love him. Um, and you're going to Green River now. Are you looking at him or me? I got you both. So you're going to Green River. And when are we going to see you again, squatter guy? 503, dude. Okay, Clown X 503. He wants to be called 503. There you go. Okay, so when are we going to see you again, 503? Uh, next week. Next week. Huh. There you go. I got work to do next week. We're not going to Sand Flats Road. We're not going to Chicken Corners. We're not going to Schaefer Trail. We're not taking the razor out. We're not doing anything. No, because I all those other days. Uh, if you want to come over and help me sand this car and get it in primer, you that's know, fine. Mr. P, he's going to come over okay. on the day you're not working. I, yeah, I, no, no. I, I want to work. Uh, look, let me show you something, okay? Watch this, Skipper. Do you see that? Do you see that problem I have here? Well, let's show off look, the damn scars. Come on. Let's show off scars. Yeah. Okay. Let's show off scars. Let's look, show off scars. Do you see that? <laughs> okay, look at me. I beat him. I beat him. Yeah, I beat him. Yeah, his scars. Oh, well, I got too many clothes on, but yeah. Your scars are nothing. Your scars are nothing. But you're not out here working, standing on concrete and everything else. And I'm the one doing all that. You're on, you're retired and on vacation. And, you know, I got a little less, a little over a month, and I'm getting this other meat done. And I can't work for about three weeks to a month and a half. I have got to get these cars done. And what you're sitting on is not a park bench. That's right. That's a paying job. Yes, it is. It's not, it, it, okay? You see what I'm, it's not a park well, bench. Why have you been working on this for two weeks? Because we've had Skipper here with us for oh, two weeks, oh, and I can't concentrate on doing this. That's why. 
Okay, so it's time to say goodbye to your cousin. For right now. Bye, see you later. See Did you see? Exactly. <laughs> see you later. Yeah, but you don't understand, dude. When you park your trailer in front of our U-Haul business, we're losing business. I'm not bringing that trailer next time. I'm Good. staying there two months. Good. I'm head west. Okay, we'll see you later, guy. <laughs> okay. We'll see you later, buddy. It's been nice knowing you. Um, You're not done with me yet. It's been nice knowing you. <laughs> uh, yeah, boom. I don't have no lame horses. They, they shoot lame horses, you know that? They shoot lame horses. Yeah. So if you keep on living around that lake, I'm going to shoot you thinking you're a lame horse. Keep it up. I will say though that Squatter Guy uh, really did a lot of work on my Baja for me and helped me out. And without his two extra hands, not his bad eyes, because I didn't know if you knew this, he's blind, right? You know that. Oh, he's blind. Let's see, what else? Oh, he can't hear. He can't hear. And the only person that he trusts that really gives him the best advice is himself when he talks to himself. Okay, I tried to tell him how to do his trailer. Listen to this shit. I said, okay, this is what you want to do. Put the ball on the hitch and don't jack it down. Just leave it right there where it's locked. And then what you do is then you hook your chains up and then you can let it down. He goes, that ain't how I do it. I said, well, how do you do it? He said, I go ahead, put the, I put the hitch on the ball and then I jack it all the way down, take all the weight off. And then I'm going to jack it all the way back up to, to where there's no weight on it. And then I'm going to put the... Uh, chains on it. Why are you fucking doing that, dude? Your, 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 your purpose of doing that is not right, Skipper. In your opinion only. Okay, but the way that I told you to do is identically, exactly, 100% the same. There you go. Okay, the hand's talking right now, guy. And it's saying that right there that says 503 has got to get out the door. Get Bobinos, leave. I got work to do. It's time to say Austin goodbye. Austin. Goodbye, Austin. sir. No, hasta la vista. Hasta la vista. Uh, you hasta never even, later. you know what? You're lucky Sammy Salami's on vacation down <laughs> in Miami because he would have had a few words to say to you, bud. I'll bet Sammy will be coming back one of these days. Well, Sammy, don't worry. He's the edit guy. He's going to make sure you look just like 503 clown guy that you fucking are. <laughs> So, yeah, um, I'm trying to be nice about the real situation, but the real situation is that has got to go. This is Pete, my friend Pete, your friend Pete. And I'm sure we'll see Clown Act 503 over here again. He actually likes to be 503. He likes to be called 503, which is fine with me. If that's what he wants, that's what he's going to get. So we're going to keep the camera on uh, because we got to film him leaving the property. Are you leaving right now? Okay, you got your dog in the truck? Okay, we'll see you later, 503. Hey, we'll see you later. Call us in a couple days. Let us know you're settled in. Okay. All right, it's a, a sad situation. See you're only living. Now, how many living relatives does Minnie the Body Shop Girl actually have? Not very many. How many you got left? He's one. I'm one. I think sister. you got what, two? Yeah, no, that would be no, no, only that's on, okay. on grandma. We don't need to go in that right now. We're not doing family history. I just oh, kind of want to know. Well, you got to go, guy. It's time to hit the road, he get does. in your truck, and leave. Goodbye. We'll see you later, buddy. See you in a couple weeks or a month. See you <laughs> Minnie the Body Shop Girl. U Haul Woman. How do you like? Look what I did here. How do you like how I did that? Well, tomorrow we need to go get a little bit more wood so we can do the edges and we're done. Our garden is finished. But I can tell you something that's not finished. And that's a guy that we call Guy, that we call 503, that we call Clown Act 503, that we call Skipper. And we also call him Scavenger. No. Uh, scab. No, not Scab. Um, What's that word I'm looking for? You know. You know. Yeah, that's him. Перебитые поломаны крылья Серой болью всю душу свело Кокаина серебряной пылью Все дороги пути замело А восьми лет школу я посещала Где сидеть сиротою была а пятнадцатый мне миновала Я курила, ругалась, пила 